All right, so you've been hanging out with this dude. But he been telling you lately that he is just so busy. He doesn't have time to fit you into his schedule. And that is a no-no. Stay tuned. Team, I love Maybe Me. Thank you so much for coming back. So here's the deal. You've been dating this guy. You've been going out with this guy. Things were going stupendous, right? And all of a sudden, he getting so busy, he ain't got no time for you. Well, I'm here to tell you that nobody is ever, ever, ever too busy for you, for the things that they want to do. I'm going to give you five tips on why he is not too busy to see you, even if he is a very busy guy. Okay, let's jump in. Number one, he's never too busy because we all, people in general, make time for the things that they really want to do. The people that they really want to see, we all make time for the people that we want to see. That's the bottom line. Even if it's 10 minutes, even if it's an hour, even if it's just a phone call, you know what I mean? We make time for the things that we want to make time for. Everybody does. Even if he is super busy, he has an hour or two between meetings or something like that, he will have a quick lunch with you if y'all schedules meet up, obviously. But I'm just saying, nobody is ever too busy for you. Number two, when a guy wants something, trust and believe me. Come here, come here. When a guy wants something, trust and believe me, nothing gets in his way of getting that thing. If you are that thing that he wants, trust me, he will get you. If you're not, He'll keep telling you daddy busy. He won't make time for you. He won't make sure that you are on, are on his schedule. He won't pencil you in. He ain't got to. All he got to do is keep saying how busy he is. And guess what? You're going to be right there. Don't do it to yourself. You don't have to stay there. You don't have to listen. You know what I mean? You don't have to be a part of that. You don't have to do the whole wondering game. Because I'm letting you know right now. If you didn't know, everybody makes time for the things that they want to make time for. Just think about it in your own life. The times that you want to hang out with people, don't you do it? You find time, you'll switch things around in your schedule. Dating is no different. If the guy really wants to see you, if he really wants you in his company, he will switch around his schedule to do just that. If he was about to hang out with the boys and you call or whatever, or, you know, thinking about something, he will fit you into a schedule. Trust and believe me, nothing Nothing will get in his way of seeing you. He will blow off his boys to see you. Number three, he's never too busy because it only takes two or three minutes out of everybody's day, especially with technology, to say hello, to call you and say, you know what, I just wanted to hear your voice. I only got a few minutes. To text and make a date or even call and make a date. Hell, you can send an email and make a date nowadays, right? We got DM, we got any way to really contact somebody and make sure that we are going to fit them in our schedules if we want to. He ain't no different. Trust me. If he's saying he's busy all the time, it's because he don't want to deal with you. Especially if he's saying he's busy and then he never comes back and say, you know what, I'm busy this day, but let's actually set up a date for this day. Does it work for you? If he's not doing that, it's because he don't want to. He don't want to. Bottom line, flat out. Don't make excuses for him. Number four, if you are a priority to him, which you should be, but if you are, if you were a priority to him, he would not make you feel as though you come way down here. You see how you can't see my hand? Way down here on his list of priorities. You would be somewhere near the top. If he really wanted to hang out with you, trust me, he ain't that busy. If you really wanted to make sure that he fit you in, trust me, he would. It don't take nothing to make sure that somebody is feeling special in his life. If he wanted to. If he's not making you feel special or feel like a priority or somebody that he wants to see, it's because he don't want to. He don't want to. I know, it's a tough pill to swallow. But, swallow that pill, get over it, and move on. You're only wasting time. And we don't have time to waste nowadays. It don't matter how old you are. You don't have time to waste. Once you get the knowledge, you have to apply it. If you see these things are happening, move on. Don't call, text, or entertain anymore. Especially if you are looking for something more serious. If you are in the playing stages, okay, fine. 
But if you're not in the playing stages, you don't have the time or energy to waste because the only thing that you are doing is blocking from somebody else from coming in who really wants what you want and they want it with you. Number five, think about this, how if you do not hear from him, right? He is not doing anything. He has now fallen into the abyss. And all of a sudden, those late night hours have come. Guess who on your phone texting? Hey, what you doing? Can I see you? You know what we should do with Netflix and chill? What does all of that sound like? Does it sound like a booty call? You got time to have sex, but you ain't got no time to fit me into your day? It's because that's all he wants is sex from you. That's all he see you as is a sex object for the moment. Trust and believe me, when he's gone after you have accepted this Netflix and chill thing, and he is gone, now the cycle starts all over again. He's pulling away. He's not making your priority. He's telling how busy he is. He's doing this. He's doing that. Meanwhile, y'all friends on social media, and you seeing that he's hanging out with this friend, this friend, and this friend. He's doing this. He's doing that. But you are never invited. He has never made time for you. He has not made you feel like a priority. And ladies, come on. Come on. Sorry to tell you, it's because you are not. So just move on with their life. Take it from your lovely coach, Marshawn. Take it from me. If he's not making time for you, sister, it's because he does not want to. All right, ladies, I know that that was kind of tough to hear today, but you must understand what's going on with these men and so you don't fall into these very traps. So if this is your very first time here to I Love Me, 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 and you want more tips and tools to be able to use in your own relationship to make it a happy, healthy one, you make sure that you go ahead, hit that subscribe button down below or the icon with my lovely face because here at I Love Me, 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 what I am doing for you is supplying you with the tips and tools so we can dramatically decrease the divorce rate by simultaneously increasing the marriage rate. I love you guys. There's just nothing that you can do about it. Mwah.